I'm here showing my worst self again. Okay, I get so frustrated when... Sometimes I'm trying to, like, I don't want to record a video, and I'm not inspired to record a video, and I don't want to record a video, and... But I have to record a video because that's where I'm making money right now. And I never understand when people, well, I don't make enough money to really worry about it. That's the problem. Like, I don't understand when people really don't make, when they're, when it's their job here and they don't make videos and uh, that I don't understand. But if I was like actually making money on here, then I would, but I guess maybe their idea of what money is and my idea of what money is. And what started this is that... I some I'm sometimes I'm not inspired. I don't, I just don't want to make a video, so I don't because I'm kind of a hedonist. And then the times that I am inspired, like right now, I said, "Oh yeah, okay, I'm gun ho, and all the elements are right for me to make a video." And then I try, and then and then my hair, and I don't know what to do with that, and then I try on a hair, and and then I, like some people, at least I don't have to get that ready. I don't have to put on makeup. I guess that's why a lot of people do behind the scenes camera in when they make the video. Maybe it's because they can show the product better than when I can show the product. I just thought, hey, if I can't record a video for my toy channel right now, well, I have the best opportunity. Maybe I can just come on here and just, you know, go take out my frustrations and get it off my chest here. And also the t-shirt the wasn't working. I decided I have to cut the sleeves off. I mean, my toy channel is called Two Hunky Toys. So I guess I should probably try to look hunky even though I don't feel hunky anymore. But I actually do want to look presentable. I don't know if that messes up with my whole like, uh, authentic realism show your worst self on social media because I hate all of this best self crap that we see people being making up this fake lifestyle how wonderful the world is that's why I always come here and I show you how horrible my life is <laughs> Because my life is really fantastic. My life is too good to be true, if you ask me. Because I don't do anything that I don't want to do, and somehow I'm still here. My biggest problem, of course, is financial. Because I don't make any money for doing the stuff that I want to do. And I just grew up learning that... Hey, if you just put all of your heart into what you love, then you can do whatever you want. And it, what it's telling me, and what I also truly believe, I don't know, maybe. Uh, no, I see people work really, really hard at their dreams and their goals. And I don't have it in me to work that hard. I just don't. See, and I'm telling myself that, right? So is that where I'm going wrong? But I, the amount of effort that I have, even in my old, way too old age, it just hasn't been enough so far. I just, and that's, that's a fact. So is that really downgrading me? I did the best I could. <sighs> All of these buzz, self-help buzzwords. I did the best I could when I could do it. I, I've always done the best I could. But I did always put my happiness first, and that is a good thing to do. I love being inspired. I hate that things aren't always, when I'm feeling inspired, things aren't always working to my favor to go along with that. I wonder. I mean, <laughs> hiring, hiring other people, like if... You know how how easy it would be to make videos if I had someone just following me around? Like, I don't understand why the people who, you know, are making enough money 
to make videos, don't just hire somebody to follow them around with the camera and then hire an editor and they don't have to do anything. All they have to do is live their life. And it probably would be good enough. People love that. I love that. I love real life YouTube. But then I think the people on YouTube that are my age, what they have to offer is so much more. It's like usually the people my age are offering financial advice. I can't give you that. I'm just here to explode. Another thing that I'm, a lot of people think that I really need a psychiatrist. I, I don't think I need a psychiatrist. I mean, I probably could benefit from one, but I don't think I need one. I think this is good enough. It always makes me feel better. Again, everyone thinks that uh, I feel so miserable, but because I come here when I am questioning everything, but for the most part, every single day of every single hour is just me doing things that I love. And I don't understand people who are bored because I have i don't remember the last time I was bored. There's always something that I want to do. There's always like even a TV show that I want to watch. I've said this before. I always, I even, I watch the same TV shows, series over and over again because I guess I feel like they're my friends and they're characters that I can rely on. They're always there for me and I really enjoy their company and I love how they're written and they're just like the perfect friends. No disappointments. I wonder how many people are in my situation this year where they're going to be, you know, alone for the holidays, how that's going to play on them. I guess most people would still Skype or something. I don't Skype. I don't have holidays. Did I cut off both sleeves already? Awesome. That means things are working well. <sighs> I think I've got a lot of stuff done during this period do I at least look presentable self-conscious about showing armpit hair to children but I think most of the channel most of the people who are watching my uh, toy channels that or at least that are commenting are like uh, older ladies and I really like that they're grandmothers and that is actually the demographic that I really want to have uh, I've always preferred the company of old ladies anyway. I'm sorry if I'm calling you an old lady. I don't know if they come to this channel the most. Uh, but uh, <laughs> Manic. Am I manic? <laughs> Maybe I'm manic. Up lows and highs. No, it, it, it's uh, it's not as bad as, you know, when you, I, when you see, when I, like, look at somebody who is in trouble, they're usually, you know, when somebody is depressed, they're in their bed for days on end. I wish I could stay in my bed for days on end. I haven't left the house in, can I be on, I, do I know when I went? I, like, every time I run an errand, of course, I have to go toy shopping so I have to stop so it's good when I don't leave the house that's why I don't want to leave the house because then I don't buy anything because I buy too much I've got a lot of hauls that I have to do but I think they're mostly toy hauls yeah I did a haul on this channel just net because and that stuff was from probably back before September because I don't buy that much stuff that's not toys or food I should do more food hauls this channel has not been getting very many views recently which is upsetting. I think I think I look okay. Really, I don't like the lighting here. Like, oh, what is that? It's not. That's not the right there. Yeah, I don't. I'm not. It's it's still too dark. After I've got these blaring lights on me, it's just. I guess the kind of camera. I'm not going to invest in a more expensive camera until I am making. Uh, enough money like to do that 
I'm going to use what's easiest and fastest, and uh, when I can afford to do better, that's when I'll do better. I love you. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. We'll see you next time. <laughs>